the girl the man with the black mask the faceless driver He was there everywhere. It was a dream. Encroaching, stifling, Andrea. A red somewhere dreams are repressed realities of your subconscious. But how could this dream be a part of my subconscious? It was an assortment of absurdities. The faceless driver. the accident the girl the man with the black mask he was who made it so unreal so dramatic only in drama one could be so vulnerable so at risk he was there everywhere everything led to him he was embodiment of pure evil he was a thelo coming to kill testimony he was strangling the girl it seemed he was strangling me how dreams personalities seem to vanish He was the one who made it impossible not to believe. It was a dream. I heard them. I heard all of them thinking and believe me. 
it is not as exciting as it sounds. Imagine yourself hearing people thinking of you as an object, a thing to use and then throw away. Sounds can be intimidating when you cannot identify one from another. Good morning. Hi. Sense ceases to exist when that happens. Sensibility too. I could not know why things were molding themselves before me the way they were. Was it all because of the dreams? Were there others who could hear thoughts? Or was my mind hallucinating? The masked man. Man with the mask. The knife. I thought of the masked man and the girl he was strangling. She was scared. Her face was the face of fear itself. One should be brave, but how one can be? Stripped of dreams? Human morality? I did not know how I came to hear people think. I had to find out. I dreamt. I saw a guy with a knife. I woke from a dream. I don't know what is happening to me, but I can read what is there in the people's mind. You have the ability of clairvoyance. Yes, ability to see hidden things. What is it? Clairvoyance. What do you mean by clairvoyance? Existence of paranormal and psychic ability. Clairvoyance has not been supported by any scientific evidence. Yes, clairvoyance, parapsychology, and pseudoscience. Yeah. I'm asking you, what has happened to me? The intuitiveness. The ability to see hidden things and know things which have been told. Yes. Others will say, others see through dreams. Others actually hear the spirit talk to them. Others, their dreams. And Miss Pianka, if I may ask. Oh, she's gone. But nothing could help. Not even Mr. Craig.
Hello? Hello? Anybody in? Hello? Alano? Alano? What happened to you, Alano? Look at me! What? What does it mean to be a woman in India? To be the coolest person in school. To be that friend to whom you could tell your somber secrets and ludicrous dreams. To be that person who you fall in love with. To be the person with liveliest dreams and most fantastic notions. To be a person living in thick of emotions, love, anger, passion, pain. To be the only one impeccable amongst the torn multitudes. It means to be alive in a lively nation. I belong here. I belong to this civilization and this age. I belong to this country. I have friends in this country. Friends I trust. Dolly. Yeah, Priya ka phone aaya tha. Ek baar phone kar le usse. Who should pass off as a mother any given day? Mira bag. अरे ये यार. ये बहुत important documents थे. आज college में ढूंढती रही. मिले ही नहीं मुझे. तू किससे बात कर रही है? ओए. तेरी बात होगी है क्या कह रही थी वो हाँ हो गई है विमी एक्चुअली ना उसकी माम की तबीयत खराब है वो बोल रही थी कि वो the only one who laughs at all my jokes however terrible they are very good अतः तुझे वो पूछ रहा था Here, I can dream. I can dream to be a lawyer and be in those dusky wooden chambers with towering shelves and voluminous books. I can dream to be. One day, 
learned enough to converse in the language of the biggest constitution of the world. I can dream to write a book or maybe even more. Here, dreams come true. Triveth, with whom I share a dream. Today we are treating together the law, people and the land. India is a great nation with solid strong foundation with the sweat of our great forefathers. Suresh and Manish, out of my class. What did I do? I said out of my class. I don't know what you want. The right to life constitutes one of the fundamental rights of the constitutions. You want to play a speed run? Don't worry, let the class finish. This right is up for severe interpretation and debates. I am always beautiful. I wish I was like my girlfriend. I want to show her photo in my album. All in all, don't worry, I'll take a photograph with you on your graduation day. Today in India, you, concentrate. Done. I was happy that day. I was leaving one of those dreams. The dreams tend to meet even quicker than we thought. They turn to nightmares. जब से आने तुम्हें देखा है Is there a thing called life? Can it be violated, trod, and crossed upon? Is it really that easy to break someone? And if it is, then what's a broken life worth? Neha, Neha, Dolly. हाँ क्या? देखो ना, Neha को क्या हो गया? Is it really you? we walk with? Is human figure really that distant from soul? If not, then why does it feel in the bottomless abyss of one's heart that it ought to be much better after death? Can you trust your friends? How can one investigate friendships? 
our loyalty is to be tested. Can nations do that? If they can, what is the punishment for betrayal? Can you trust yourself? When do you know you are undreaming? When do you know your dreams have been brutally smothered? When do you know your life has ended? When do you know your life has ended? You know, somehow. क्या हुआ तुमको ओए, ऐसे क्यों चली आई वहां से क्या हुआ है तुझे नेहा मैं तुझसे बात कर रही हूँ वॉट हैपन टू यू क्या हुआ नेहा बताया भी नहीं मैंने तुझसे पूछा भी तूने बताया नहीं बता नेहा हम तुझसे बात कर रहे हैं फोन ला नेहा मैंने तुझे बुलाया तुमने कुछ रिप्लाई भी नहीं किया यार तूने कुछ खाया भी नहीं कई दिनों से न पिया बता चुप क्यों है किसी से बात भी नहीं कर रही है यार अरे यार बता देख क्या हो रहा है You know it right there and then. You know you have been betrayed by that very same civilization, that age, that nation. You know it with thousands like you. You know it with that five-year-old girl in Bangalore. You know it with that girl in New Delhi. You know it with all those around you. You know when your life has ended. You know. आजकल की लड़कियां कुछ भी कपड़े पहनकर निकल आती घर से हाँ यार सही बात है उन्हें अपना कुछ ध्यान ही नहीं रहता Good morning. All set? Everything fine? Your name? Rahul. What do you mean by Rahul? You're not supposed to sit like this. Sit properly. It's college. But it doesn't mean. Okay. Today we want to discuss about law versus morals. Who's going to tell me what is law? What do you think about law? Bolo. Law is a word still which don't have any universally accepted definition. But one definition is there. Law is a system of rules and regulation which are to be followed by the common people. These laws are made by the government and the societies. Okay, so recently we heard about different rape cases in Delhi. Women still protested, still suffering. So what do you want to know about this? 
there are more reasons people are saying girls are wearing short dresses, their dressing sense. Just want to know your opinion. What do you want to say about this? People saying rape cases are increasing. The percentage, the level of rape cases are increasing. Mom. Yes, you. Mom, I want to say that you are telling me that the small clothes and the big clothes are more rape cases. So, I want to go to the doctors. At the time of delivery, the mother and the baby are also watching the same thing. So, I want to go to the doctors. If there is a rapist, I want to go to the rest of the sense. देखिए जिस तरीके से इसने कहा कि छोटे कपड़ों से कोई फर्क नहीं पड़ता मैं ये कहना चाहूंगा कि अगर कोई लड़की घर से बाहर निकलती है तो शायद हम उसे गौर से नहीं देखेंगे तो मैं बिल्कुल मानता हूँ कि छोटी ड्रेस जो है लड़कियों को इनको बिल्कुल ध्यान देना चाहिए इनको बिल्कुल देना चाहिए उनके माँ बाप को भी मानना चाहिए कि अपने घर बाहर जो लड़कियां निकले तो फुल ड्रेस में निकले लड़कों से बच निकले आई डिस अगर आपको रिमेम्बर हो सिक्सटीन दिसंबर का केस तो उस दिन उस लड़की ने प्रॉपर ड्रेसअप किया हुआ था प्रॉपर फुल जीन्स एंड टॉप पहना हुआ था देन तो उसका रेप हुआ तो आई डोंट थिंक सो कि शॉर्ट ड्रेसेस की वजह से रेप हो रहे हैं बट बट मैम वो लड़की उस टाइम गलत समय और गलत जगह पर थी मैं आई एम ओनली गिविंग यू द एग्जांपल नहीं ये लोगों की मेंटालिटी पे डिपेंड रेप होते हैं अगर आप न्यूज में पढ़ते हैं तो दिन में भी रेप होते हैं इंडियन लोगों की मेंटेलिटी पूरा देश जानता है इसीलिए इंडिया में आई डोंट थिंक सो अगर आप न्यूज देखें आप न्यूज अगर देखते हैं या पढ़ते हैं तो आपको मालूम होगा बात दिन में रेप की नहीं है बात है लोग इंडियन लोगों की मेंटालिटी की तो मेंटालिटी स्टॉप आर्गुइंग स्टॉप वे हैव फॉर द हेल्थ डिस्कशन ओनली यू नॉट सपोज टू आर्ग्यू अनस्टर्ड Can you trust your friends? How can one investigate friendships? Are loyalties to be tested? Can nations do that? You, come out. You don't belong here. I don't understand. You don't understand. Yes. You know you're the sharp edge. Study the future. Hello. हेलो आंटी मुझे आपसे कुछ बताना है नेहा के बारे में आंटी मुझे बताना है कि वो बहुत परेशान है कुछ दिनों से बहुत डिस्टर्ब है आंटी कुछ भी खा पी नहीं रही है किसी से बात भी नहीं कर रही है और हमेशा अकेले अकेले रहती है आजकल दो तीन दिनों से आंटी इसकी बात पर ध्यान मत दीजिए हाँ नहीं कल रात ही में उससे मिली थी और मॉर्निंग में भी उससे बात हुई है हाँ जी आंटी मुझे लग रहा है उसे मलेरिया हुआ है हाँ अगर आप आ सके यहाँ पर तो उसे थोड़ा अच्छा लगेगा वो थोड़ा बेटर फील करेगी हाँ जी आंटी हाँ जी आंटी क्या कर रही हो तुम तुम इसके पेरेंट्स को टेंशन देना चाहती हो मानना चाहती हो क्या उसकी हालत देखो You gorgeous. आज मुझे तुम्हें छूने का मौका मिल ही गया हम लकी हुआ क्या यू डू नो दैट वॉट इज देर इन योर माइंड
Neha नेहा मैं चाहती हूं कि तुम अपने लिए आवाज उठाओ किसी और के लिए नहीं अपने लिए आवाज उठाओ ताकि लोगों को सच्चाई का पता चल सके नेहा Trivet, you are alleged, and to hold this allegation, silence. What do you have to say for this? I want to clear. Neha never said I did so. It's Miss Priyanka who alleged me for this. I don't understand. I have read this report. Neha has not talked to anyone after the night she went to the party. Are you aware? Yes. Do you have any discussion with Neha prior to this panel? No. Then how do you know she was? Allow Neha to speak for herself.
I heard Neha that day. No, 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 change your thought. Are you trying to influence her? I failed. When you know someone, when they're standing bare before you, without pretenses and prejudices, you can mold their thoughts the way you want. But I failed with Neha. Is there a limit to scathing emotional pain and brutal physical pain one could bear? Souls tend to grow afresh when they are brutally mutilated. Much stronger than before. Much fierce, just like Christ. Sometimes life is an unending catechism of sorts. A series of questions whose answers you would never know. What if you did know the answers? What if you did know the culprits? What can you do then? It's not all about me. Unborn generations pitted for the worst of conclusions. You lose your voice then. You know when that happens. You know somehow. There are countless souls like Christ. We need more. Maybe I'm wrong in thinking this. But maybe these are the kind of wrongs one needs in this life. I wish she lived. She lost her voice. There's much need for them. These voices, frail, incomplete, sometimes incomprehensible, but strong, stronger than all ours. The most powerful voice.